Minecraft Mentor here and today we're going to be building the refinery from Immersive Engineering. So first place down a heavy engineering block, go two blocks back, place a light engineering block, then we're going to go over two with scaffolding on each side of that, fill in the middle with a pipe like that. Next we're going to raise up for the second level another engineering block heavy and another light engineering block like that. Over that we're going to do sheet metal and then a redstone engineering block which is our second layer final layer is just to raise the sheet metal up a little bit and that's going to give us our machine you click on this heavy engineering block right here and that's going to assemble it we can uh, control this with redstone using a lever uh, we power this one right here which i have to go grab a cell here we go and uh we're inputting fluids into these tanks which are used by the refinery back there we'll get into that in a second but it powers from this little orange block right here in the back. Uh, its inputs are on the side. So you have blue here, and we can run this pipe up here now that we've built. So then that'll start inputting our fluids for us. Now the export or uh, export is up in front right next to the uh, redstone port. And you just take a pipe, and you can run it off of there. Now what this machine does is actually uh, mixes fluids. So it takes plant oil and ethanol through here and through the catalyst which we have to get and then this will give you your uh, biodiesel you can export it with a bucket or anything like that so our catalyst is a dust and I gotta find it it's right there nitrate dust so we're gonna throw in our nitrate dust and then we'll throw a lever on those tanks to start pushing everything in here and it's gonna make our uh, biodiesel for us. As you can see it's filling up. Don't forget the nitrate dust. It just mixes these in equal parts, one bucket to one bucket through the nitrate. You only need one nitrate dust. It doesn't consume this to actually make the biodiesel, but it does act as a catalyst in order to get that. And then if you just want to put it in a tank, it'll automatically export once it has somewhere to go. And we can just fill it up and run this line over here and then it's going to automatically export the biodiesel out of this tank into a much larger tank and that's pretty much it for this one if you found it helpful like comment subscribe